channel so today we are checking out from holiday and express in glasgow and we'll be driving up north towards fort william yes so today's journey would be breathtaking so keep watching our video till the end so most of the holiday in hotels have breakfast included we had our breakfast before checking out and then started our journey variable speed so you need to adhere to this speed A Highland road trip is a must for your Scotland bucket list and the scenic drive along the A82 road towards Glencoe Valley is definitely one of the best drives in the country This is the toilet situation in Scotland road trip. You can park your car. You can use the public toilet, or you can go and eat or drink in these cafes, and you can use their toilets. ट्रिप करते करते स्कॉटलैंड में वैसे पार्किंग करके देखिए पीछे का व्यू ट्रू ऑस ये सब लाइव अपडेट्स आपको इंस्टाग्राम में मिलेगा हमारा इंस्टाग्राम हैंडल फॉलो कीजिए एट रेट फॉलो द इम्प्रेट्स क्योंकि यूट्यूब में वीडियो थोड़ा लेट से जाता है इंस्टाग्राम में एकदम लाइव चला जाता है So we can't stress enough of the beauty of Scotland. I mean, can you see this mountain? It says snow-capped mountains right behind us. Here, here, and like everywhere. And this is so scenic. Like every this car, every bus. Yeah, this whoever, is 360 degree. Yeah. Whoever was crossing this road, everybody stopped here. So this is 360 degree view. Not only one side. You can see everywhere. Welcome to the Glencoe Valley of the Scottish Highlands. It is considered as the most romantic glen or narrow valley of Scotland. The landscapes are worthy of a postcard and for ages this area has been an inspiration for the creatives. Who remembers the scene from the famous Bond movie Skyfall? Yep, you guessed it right. This has been shot in Glencoe.
you are here so the wire duct has two view point wire duct view point and the bridge view point and i know you don't know what is wire duct Very you'll sorry. get to know we'll show you what is the wire duct Welcome to the Glenfin and Viaduct. Those who are Harry Potter fans like ourselves, this bridge needs no introduction. So the famous Harry Potter train actually went from this bridge and you can physically see that train which is known as the Jacobite steam engine but that runs generally in the summer months not in this time of the year unfortunately so we cannot see it but you can definitely come and check their website and see the timetable and plan your visit accordingly so that you can see from here the steam engine running through this line and this viaduct has been opened in the year of 1898 and after harry potter it became really famous and became a tourist attraction as well da, na, we are just imagining na, the harry potter na, train na, here moving through this viaduct scotland is beautiful i mean we are we are speechless we are speechless meters at the roundabout take the second exit Yeah, it is. <laughs> Where is that ferry? It's taking just over to the other side. There's a wee village over there, but it's just to connect the two lands. Oh, not, okay, okay. If you don't have going over there, it's not that much there. You know, you can have a wee walk about, but there's not there's much nothing. there. Okay. 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 So there's an extra toilet in here. Uh huh. This is the lounge is for everybody there's coffee and tea there you can help yourself and you can sit in here Okay this is yeah, this is big Come to me Oh <laughs> There's coffee and tea again as a microwave and toaster you can just if you want to cook I don't know what you want to do for tonight Get out of the room So you in between the lounge and Oh, this is cozy. Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you, the heating you just regulate yourself. If you want it warmer, uh -huh. you know, like just turn it up. But the heating doesn't come on till four o'clock. You know. So we just checked in at Koran Bunkhouse for one night. We have a private room and shared utilities. This is our room. It's a very nice and cozy place. So this is a queen size bed. We have some storage here. TV. A heater, bedside tables. Oh, that's a mirror. And the washroom is actually pretty big. It's huge, and the location is the best part. This Koran Bank House it is located at Onage, which is in between Fort William and Glencoe. This is a very nice space. The location is very good, and we will highly recommend it. We just have been here for like half an hour, and we are already loving this place. The owner is so nice. She was very nice. She showed around all the areas where we can access. And the best part is, which Ranjit will show you later on, is there is an honesty box. So everything here it's fifty pence. And you can take and pay. That's why it is honesty box. 
very good concept this cost us around 98 canadian dollars for one night and we booked it yesterday so might if you book it earlier you might get it a bit cheaper no food is included here uh, you can bring your own food and cook there are three kitchens and this is the living space and they have decorated about all this christmas and everything for the guests so it's really nice and uh, they have in suit heater and the room is spacious so this location is surrounded with mountains and lakes it is so serene the place is so calm there is no noise i can only hear my noise if i just listen nothing it was so peaceful when you stop talking <laughs> so this is our tomorrow's route so this ferry only connects these two towns and this is a typical fare for car but for walking for normal passengers without car it's free guys for watching this video till the end and we hope that you have really enjoyed our scotland vlog as much as we love the drive today so keep watching and supporting us and do subscribe if you haven't already and share this one with your friends and family and please press the like button and the bell icon to get further notification till then follow the imprints